All right, so let's, this is how you test it on your calculator. So if you wanted to enter a sequence in and see what you would get, you could do it like this. You could say the function, so we would say 3 times, and then in parentheses put negative 2 raised to the, oops, I did a double thingy there, raised to the, it doesn't matter, you could put n or x. Uh, then I'm going to put a comma. And then I got to put the lower boundary. Well, first I got to define what it is. So I'm going to say x. Then I got to put a comma, lower boundary, which is, well, in this case, zero. And let's just do a comma, the upper boundary. So what do we want to go to? Infinity. Not infinity, you guys. Wait, shouldn't it be x equal to How many terms do we have? Shouldn't it be x equal to Four. No, that's not how that works. Okay, let's see what we get. Boom. What? That's wrong. That's absolutely correct. <laughs> See how that worked? That's absolutely